welcome back to Ishmi's World for the first time in a very long time. We're back at the airport and we're going to Boracay. Woo! <laughs> so this first video is going to be uh, entirely about the procedure of uh, that you need to go through um, when flying on a domestic flight here in the Philippines right now. So it's October and Sabina is super strict. There's no PCR testing required. Actually, to be honest, I don't know if I'm happy or not about that. October 2022, yun daw. Super yun. Okay, so yeah, I'm here with my sister and the parents over there. Ayan. Nandito kami sa, ano, sa hallway nung, nung naiya Terminal 3 kasi super crowded dun sa, ano, dun sa gate. So, since we're a little bit early, may ibang flight pa na na nandun sa gate namin. So, we're waiting here and social distancing from other passengers. And actually, I got so annoyed because um, it's still required to wear masks. But um, everyone here seems to be complying. But there was this group of women in front of us that uh, just refused to wear them. So guys, in yung gate namin, punong puno, daming tao. Kaya good idea na kanina dun lang kami sa malayo. Ito sa may space. Now, ayan, almost boarding naman na. Pero, yeah, super crowded here. So, ayan na. Starting na yung boarding. And it's medyo haggard pa. So, dito muna kami sa malayo for now. Because, Anyway, um, we already have no our seat numbers and all that. We naman not have to So, we don't have to go Okay, we're finally here on the plane. Ayan, wala are not going to Really good. Ayan. And the parents are here. Ito, ayan. Hello, mommy and daddy. Ayan, so... Ready to go na kami. We boarded last kasi nandito na kami sa pinakaharap. So, okay naman. Um, the boarding procedure was uh, pretty painless. Um, we just had to show them the boarding pass and of course, um, our ID. So, that was it. Super uh, easy boarding. Okay, so we finally landed. I don't know if you can hear me kasi may ingay pa yung plane. But ayan, we're here at Boracay. And parang iba na yung airport actually. Kasi look, kita na yung kita na yung dagat here. Or baka na sa kabilang side lang. I think this was the one that this side yan. I saw that before last time I was here. Parang under construction na yan eh. Pero hindi pa rin siya tapos. We're heading now to baggage claim. Um yeah, it looks like ito nga yung dati. I mean, pre-pandemic, ito na siya. Ayan, I remember this. Itong very, ano, very primitive way of claiming your baggage. Ganun pa rin. Ayan. Lalapag lang nila ito yung mga bags. Walang mga conveyor-conveyor dito. And walang aircon. So actually, we bo we booked um, transfers via Ken Water Sports. I didn't book via my hotel this time because the last time I was here, they didn't offer private vehicle. Puro shared lang. I didn't really wanna, you know, um, because of COVID and everything. I didn't wanna uh, share a van because it's super sinisiksik nila de ba like full capacity yung van, like 10 to 12 people. So I didn't want to do that this time. So we got our own private van, um, both from airport to the jetty port and from the jetty port to our hotel. So let's see how it goes. So I don't understand why nandun sa labas yung mga ibang tao. They have to go out to go to their vehicle. Weird. Baka kami rin ganun. Dito yung mga ibang van sa loob. Pero yung mga ibang tao, kailangan lumabas. So, ito na. Ayan na daw yung van namin. Okay. 
Ayun, ano ba nangyari? Kala ko yun na. Ah, do Kailangan doon. Oh, okay, thank you. So, maglalakad pa rin, pero at least dito na lang sa parking pala. Ayan, wait lang. Okay, we have to walk. Ayan na siya. Okay, we're now at the van. Ano kami lang. Which is much safer. Ayan. So, yeah. We're ready to go to the jetty park. Okay, so ito na yung medyo haggard na part. QR code, box card, and... Ay. Ayan, so medyo magulo dito. Ang daming tao. Ayan. Bakit nandito si Sir Marlon? Ayan, to assist us. Um, and before we arrive here, um, the guys at Ken Watersports already helped me and helped me print out in QR. Uh, no, well, not print out, but they sent me the QR and um, our IDs and vaccination cards in one document. So, para madali na. Hopefully, wala namang problem. Okay, ayan. Medyo, ang gulo lang here. Ang daming tao. Saan ba? Medyo matari lang yung mga ate. Here. Ayan. Ayan, bin-verify na ni Ate Girl. <laughs> Thank you, Ate. Thank you. And verification process is ongoing for the four of us. Ayan yung mga QR code namin, IDs, and vaccination cards, along with the hotel booking. Okay, so after ko ma-verify yung QR code, uh, si Kuya Marlon na yung bahala to get our tickets, ayan, to the ferry, to go to the island. So parang step one was to get to the airport, step two was to fly here, step three, uh, get on the van to make it to the jetty port and then my two legs pa uh, take the boat to the island itself and then another van to the hotel. So yun lang, kailangan mo pa palang i-fill out yung passenger manifest. Medyo marami talaga siyang steps. So, reserve seats yung ferry boat. Pero sobrang init na. Actually. Ayan. Si Kuya Porter. Thank you, Kuya. Ayan. Reserve seats tayo. So, hopefully, hindi naman masyado crowded. Pero parang pupunain pa rin naman nila. Lahat ng available seats. Okay. Super hulas levels na tayo, guys. Ang init. I swear. Grabe. Ang init dito. Pose to pose na ako. And then, ayan. Malapit na itong mapuno. Ayan. So, once it starts moving, medyo may hangin-hangin naman. So, medyo nakakahinga na tayo. Actually, nakakainis kasi 4 p.m. daw. 
Eh, di ba dati yung standard check-in is free? Pero ngayon po na. We're now here at Astoria Current and I'm checking in. And hi! Okay, that was the end of our video for uh, the Boracay transfers from Manila all the way up to here in Boracay. We're now here at Astoria Current and welcome drinks time! So, sabi naman nila, hindi naman daw 4 o'clock yung room. Hopefully, mas maaga-aga kami maka-check in kasi haggard na kami. So now, yeah, we're enjoying some iced tea and bibingka. Okay, room tour later.